And now, your WLKY weather with Chief Meteorologist Jay Cardosi. All right, gang, less than three weeks until the Christmas holiday. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about snow chances the next five to seven days. What's happening? Well, first off, let's take a look at the current snow cover. A little bit of snow on the ground as we speak up around Chicago, the Great Lakes, through portions of the Northeast, also the higher elevations out there in the Rockies. Aside from that, not much close to home. And as we go out the next five to seven days, even though it's going to be kind of an active pattern, it looks like it's going to be mainly rain around here. Little or no snow expected in our area. Could be a little bit in the upper Midwest, the Great Lakes, the spine of the Appalachians. But folks, again, that looks to be just about it taking you forward the next five to seven days. So once again, little or no snow the next week. But hey, we'll watch it close and hopefully we can turn that around a little bit as we get closer to the Christmas holiday. We've certainly seen a little bit of shower activity kind of scattered about the region, and we still have maybe a couple of sprinkles north of Cordon, a little bit of light rain near Bloomfield, northeastern Nelson County. This activity will quickly wind down the rest of the overnight period as drier air really starts to funnel in to the region. So your detailed 24 hour forecast, we're gonna hold on to a lot of clouds overnight through the first half of tomorrow. Listen, tomorrow's gonna be a quiet day, but it's gonna be a chilly day. Plenty of clouds still floating through. Temperatures in the middle 40s, that's it, that's all. And we'll kind of settle back into the 30s as we push into tomorrow evening. Outside right now, clouds, chilly conditions. The numbers today, 50 and 37, but look, that's just about where it should be for the time of year. At this time, we're 45 degrees, humidity 74%, northwesterly breezes 5 to 10, so the feel like down around 41. Bus stop weather, we're talking middle and upper 30s tomorrow morning. Plenty of clouds, your future cast showing those clouds overnight through tomorrow morning, then as we move through the afternoon, those things should start to break up a little bit, more in the way of sunshine peeking through. But again, those temperatures still chilly and below average tomorrow, mid 40s on your Wednesday. The good news, after tomorrow, we warm things up. We'll be close to 60, here we go, Thursday afternoon. Same with increasing clouds on Friday. Here's your forecast for the overnight. Cloudy skies, chilly conditions, 38 on that low. Your 12-hour forecast for tomorrow, upper 30s in the morning, a slow climb to 45 in the afternoon, a little bit of late-day sunshine. Five-day forecast, 60 Thursday, close to that Friday, 65 on Saturday, but the trade-off, impact weather will be moving in through the weekend. Pretty strong storm system will come at us from the west starting late Saturday, Saturday night, and Sunday, and Vicki with that. Good chances for rain, maybe even a thunderstorm. Once that thing passes through, it will be turning decidedly colder as we go from 65 Saturday to 45 Sunday and hold in the 40s early next week as well. But how about those 60s showing up? It looks up good. Thursday Just and Friday. Just give us a little something to smile about there, don't you? Absolutely. <laughs> Thanks, Jeff.